Why is your bedroom door wedged? I can't get the Hoover in. I don't know how you got out this morning. Well, I think that's my business, Mr. Wilkes. Oh. Well, do you think you could sort your business out so I can clean your room? Oh, I don't need cleaning. You haven't hoovered upstairs for weeks. Well, it can wait till after Christmas. What have you got in there? <laughs> Note. Already got a pianola in there. Three cases full of stuffed birds, statuette of Queen Victoria, the one arm missing, and 20 volumes of the complete electrical engineer from 1925 onwards. Uh, I'm beginning to wonder if your bedroom doesn't defy the basic laws of the universe. Hmm? In that it's bigger inside than it is outside. Well, it's not a small room. You've got something new, haven't you? Yeah. After I've expressly forbidden the importation of any more white elephants into this house, you've done it again. Just a few, Mr. Wilkes. Very tiny. Hardly big hardly enough to... Hardly big enough to take up all the remaining space and make it virtually impossible to get in and out. I don't wish to hear any more, Mr. Wilkes. It seems to me that when it comes to objects da, Philistinism is order at day on your part at premises. Well, I'm glad to say it's not on mine. <laughs> 